Hey Brandon, I'm glad to be here. Tell me what's going on in the barrel shop today. Ken, welcome. Um, we've got a lot for you to see here today. Um, we we take everything from a we cover all the operations of barrel manufacturing in-house, um, from buttoning to contouring to final operations. We've got a lot for you to see. Well, listen, I look forward to seeing what's going on. What do you say you give me the tour? All right, we'll do it. And Ken, what we've got here is a is a raw blank. This is. When we get raw material in, we'll first establish a length, and then we'll come in and do a little prep work on the ends, and uh, we'll go completely through the process from drilling to reaming to honing to buttoning. The first machine will be our drill machine, which is behind us. One behind, behind us. That's correct. Um, after we drill, we'll also ream on that same machine okay. to an established size, and then third third step will be the hone, which is running which on is this here. side. That's correct. Cool. Um, so the honing basically preps it for the actual rifle the buttoning Correct. Yeah. We, we establish that final size for the button. Then we'll go to our buttoning machine behind us and we'll actually pull the button through and establish the rock thing in it. When it comes out of the button machine, I'm going to assume there's an inspection process where you make sure the barrel's That's to correct. the level you want? Um, we go through, at almost nearly every step, we go through different inspection processes. So it's... it's yeah, you know, I know that both Bill and Ryan Set a pretty high standard for the quality that's, of their barrel. That's correct. And I know the reputation of them as far as shooting is. Everybody I talked to is pretty impressed with how well they perform. Yes, we're we're very proud of them, and we we hold that that same uh, line of thinking throughout our whole process of making the premier product we can. Hey Greg, what you got going on here today? Well, uh, I've got a barrel blank here that uh, we start with after it's been uh, heat treated, drilled, rifled. We work our way through, start our contour process. We do the uh, rear profile, then we chamber, pop the extension on there, check the headspace out on it. And, and the pin on the extension is what helps align it with the upper receiver. And that's basically where you, at that point, the extension is where you get your locking lugs for your bolt lock Yes. Up. Make sure the head space is correct. Cool. And we work our way through, finish the front profile, cut off the waste material. Let me ask you this. I noticed at this point the barrel's marked with the caliber and the logo. Is that part of this last step you have right here? That is all done in our last op. It's uh, the gas port. The set screw dimple, the fluting, the engraving, all done at the one op. Cool, and what's the last barrel? That has been bead blasted. That's uh, that's final product right there, 308 Winchester. Well, that's pretty neat. Listen, I gotta ask you one more question, Greg. What in the heck is this? Well, what we got here is a little bit of a new product we got going here. It's the, uh, the X9 barrel. Whoa, that's cool. So basically, you machine every way, everything it doesn't look like an X9 barrel, and you're good to go. That's correct. That's pretty neat. Hey, thank you, Greg. I appreciate the rundown of what's happening. No problem.